This is the plaintiff, Amy Nichols. She says she had a one-time sexual encounter with the defendant, and she let him record it for his own private use. Turns out he posted the video on a website without her authorization. This was an act of revenge porn, which is illegal, and she's here suing him for the $6,000 she's owed. This is the defendant, Byron McCovery. He says his tryst with the plaintiff was never recorded, and out of nowhere, the plaintiff starts accusing him of posting a video to an online site. This woman's trying to frame him because he makes good money, and she is a gold digger, plain and simple. Bottom line, he's not in any sex tape video, and he's here today to clear his name. He's accused of doing a bad thing. The defendant has filed a counter suit for $3,500 for wasting his time and emotional distress. All parties, please, you're right here. You see, they come to order, please. The dance have been sworn, Your Honor. Thank you, Douglas. You're welcome, ma'am. Okay. Hi. Hi. You've come to court today to sue for $6,000 in damages that you say you've sustained as a result of this defendant posting a sex tape of you. Yes. All right, tell me how it is that you know him. I know Mr. McCovery through Facebook. Uh, we are in a group on Facebook together and that's where we actually interact at. I don't interact with him on my regular page or on my timeline or anything like that. What was the focus of the group? Just a bunch of friends or was there uh, something about it? Just a messy group. Okay. So that's how you meet him, and then do you meet him in person? I met him in person the night of the encounter. Okay, and that was a one-night stand? Yes. Okay, you allowed him to tape. Who did the taping, you taped or he taped? He taped. He taped. Did you know he was taping? Yes. And why did you, I'm not trying to judge you, but I have to ask, it seems kind of like a bad idea, a guy you don't know on a one-night stand to allow him to keep a tape of you, you know, and make I a tape of you. In all honesty, the night in question of when we did have sex, um, the defendant and I were both on ecstasy pills. Uh, the initial thing was we were going to meet up for me to sell him ecstasy pills. Okay, and, that's honest, all right. And that in itself is why I was For sold. judgment. Yes. Okay, so nothing happens for some time, and then what happens? In February of 2018, I think the date was actually February 21st of 2018, a okay. friend of mine inboxes me through Facebook, and he shows me a screenshot of the site with my picture on it. Okay, so hold on. So a friend of yours is on a porn site, Yes. And he tells you that you are on a porn site. Yes, I actually asked him how he found it and he said that uh, he was looking up BBWs and so on and so forth. And a lot of the words that he was putting in to find videos was matching of the defendant's description video. And he said, that's how he found me. What's BBW? BBW is just another term for a black. voluptuous female. Okay, but, oh, woman. That's yes. what the, I'm, what's a W for? Big black right, woman okay. or? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. So he sends a picture where there is a face and it appears that the person is having oral sex with a man. And that guy recognized you? I'm under the assumption that he watched it and that's how he knew it was me and okay. then sent it to me. Okay, because <clears throat> I'm gonna need to watch it. I don't want to watch it, but that's the lawsuit you brought but I need to understand a few things before I watch it. So he sees the video, because from the screenshot, I can't tell. So he sees the video, he calls you, says, this is you. And then do, does he send you the video or just the screenshot? He sent me the screenshot, and after I seen that, Did you the, know from looking at the screenshot exactly yes, what it was? from the picture on the screenshot, I knew what that was. Why, how did you know? Because I didn't know what that video is. Okay. I've uh, seen the video. He sent me the video. When did he send you the video? After it was made, like, if it wasn't that night, it was like the next day. Okay. So just by looking at the screenshot, you know who you had been with and you knew what encounter it was. Yes, ma'am. You didn't need anybody to give you help to, you know, you know it's, it's him. Yes, that's, <laughs> he's the only one I did a video with. Oh, that's what I'm asking, yes, really? Yes, yes, ma'am. Okay. All right, so what do you do? Do you call him? I immediately call him. And what do he say? 
at first he didn't answer. And then when he finally does pick up the phone, he's pretending like he doesn't know what's going on. He claimed that his phone was lost, that he did not upload it to Pornhub. Uh, I, Can you tell by looking at Pornhub whose account it is? They have a profile and on his uh, Pornhub profile, there's like a small picture of him. And I've seen that same picture of him on his Facebook page. And that's how I, but I mean, that is the only video I've done. And so I didn't need to figure out who it was from that profile. It's, What's going on? It's all a bogus claim. I met the young lady a couple years ago. I'm a pretty likable, popular guy on social media. Are you? Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am, I, I believe so. And, okay, um, did you post her video on a porn site? No, ma'am, I did not. Okay. I've explained that to her. Um, Who did? How did the video that you took end up on a porn site? Oh, by the way, the porn site, whoever uploads it gets paid each time it's looked at, right? Yes, and I did not know that. I never received um, any payment because I never posted it. Is it a, your account? No, it's not. And I never put a video of me and this young, la young lady up. Well, how would the video get out? I'm not aware of the... The video um, was in your possession. Me and her have never did a video. Oh, you've never done a video with her? No, ma'am. Okay, when did you, you have sex you, with her? When you look at this video... Listen to me, did you have sex with her? No, I did not. You've never had sex with her? No, ma'am. We've talked before. That, no, I didn't ask if you've talked before. I asked if you had sex with her. I'm being very clear in my question. Have you ever had sex with that woman? That's my question. What's your answer? No, ma'am. Okay. So your testimony is not your body, not your sexual encounter, you never did a tape, and this is not your porn site, and you did not upload this? Yes, ma'am. Okay. When you look at the video, you, will never, you, you won't see me or any of my body parts on the video. Okay. And When I, I look at the video, the... am I gonna see that the person who posted it is you? No, ma'am. Okay. What? I was gonna say that he sent me the video. You won't see his face because he's the one recording it, but you will hear his voice. Do you have the actual raw video that he sent you back then? Yes, ma'am, I do. I actually, when I was notifying him about me finding out about him putting that on Pornhub, I told him that I still have the conversation between me and him from when he sent it to me. Let, yeah, let me see it. I think the young lady trying to frame me. And, Is um, this a video he posted? Yes. So on Pornhub, this exactly that I'm looking at is what they would see? Yes. She's posted the video um, numerous of times. What do you mean? She put the video on Facebook. <laughs> when? She posted, I believe it was 20, around February 21st. Of what year? 2018. Okay, now prove that. So go on Facebook and show me how you are proving to me that she posted it on Facebook. There's two videos right here. Okay, is that, now if I click on that, I will see that she's put it, posted it on her Facebook page. She's, she's, she's going live on Facebook saying that she sent it to, she sent it out to someone who at the time claimed that they were pregnant from me. She sent it to this young lady with hopes that it, she would recognize me. Okay, stop. Oh, uh, yeah. No, just a second. So the proof you have is her posting the following video on Facebook where she's explaining things, right? Okay, let me see that. And yes. what date was that post? Does it say it? It was all the same, it was all the no, same. No, no, all the same doesn't work, you see? Because when you're a fact finder and you're trying to figure out what happened before, what, ah, at the same it time, the same is date. a messy way that litigants talk, but judges don't. So these are video of video, right? All right, I need to know the actual dates. Do you have them, yes or no? Yes, ma'am. Okay, what yes. are the dates? The 21st, February 21st. That's Feb the date that's the day that, that she's video. talking in this video. Yes, ma'am. It's February 21st of what year? 2018. Okay, all right, now here's a video. Why'd you send it to her? 
because she also had sex with the defendant and I sent it to her because he was denying that it was even him or he even posted the video. When did you send it to her? After you found it on Pornhub? Yes, or before after you I found it on Pornhub. And the reason that you sent it to her was that so you would have another witness that that was in fact him? Yes. But is in his picture right on the... Uh, yes. Okay. This is what? That's a, a post. A post on Facebook from what day? Uh, the 21st of February. When do you find it in Pornhub? I found out about it on the 21st of February. 2018? 2018. 2018. Why, Why did you wait so long to file a lawsuit? I'm curious. <laughs> it doesn't matter. She's within the statute of limitations. I'm just curious. I went, when this first happened, when it exactly first happened, I had warrants. So I figured I won't, I can't press charges against him because they would arrest me too. So I turned myself in. And in that time frame, I asked the officers, could I press charges? And they told me it was more of a civil matter and that I would have to take him to court. They wouldn't be able to arrest him. Uh, the revenge porn is just, just So the delay the was until, the delay was what? To resolve your criminal cases? I don't understand why you delayed. I, I guess I'm trying to figure out why you delayed. You had warrants out, that's why you didn't file it in February. But what changed your mind? <sighs> Mr. McCovery, I feel like is antagonizing. Here and there he'll speak. Talk. He's also inboxing me saying, and this reminded me of you. And I just, it feels like I'm being violated. Okay. Basically. So every blue moon, he would just text you something that would remind if you. If we were, if there was a post that came up in the group and I make a comment, he'll, hey, Amy. And it's no longer up, right? No, it's no longer on Pornhub. And that same day, he took it down. Okay. When everything hit the fan and you were accusing yes. him and, okay. So how soon after you had sex with them did you discover it had been posted? We had sex in December. I found out in February. Okay. All right, so what I'd like you to, and when did he send you the tape? He sent me the tape in December. In December, yes, right afterwards? Yes, ma'am. Okay, how is it that I have you sending her the tape if you didn't get taped and you didn't send her the tape? That wasn't my Facebook that sent that to her. Welcome back to the People's Court, Harvey Levin here. So, I have a question. I mean, this is uh, it's just a thing. You know, it was with Kim Kardashian, it was with Paris Hilton, it was with a million people. It's just done now. Would you guys ever consider, I, I, just not trying to pry, but who here would do a sex tape? Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> For sure I'll do a sex tape. No, I'm not, I, I, I'm not soliciting it, I'm just asking. Oh, yeah. You would do it? Yeah. I, 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 a lot of people wonder why. I mean, people say, well, it's like kind of putting yourself out there. Uh, to show my skills, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> I've got people looking like this right now. Uh, what do you say? Why wouldn't you? Uh, I think it's, you know, that's something personal. You know, it's between you and your, you know, significant other. I wouldn't want to put this, our, you know, personal life out there. Well, you don't have to release it to somebody. You can just... Oh, then in that case, yeah, we could do it. No. With, yeah, Go, you, uh, not, you, <laughs> going inside the courtroom. Give me your phone again with the texts. What text? What's, what, what's the number? That, that's... Your inbox conversations. Yeah, that's what I mean. I'm sorry. I'm saying it wrong. Your inbox conversation on Facebook. That's what we're looking at, right? Yes. Is that right? Okay. Yes. So if I scroll up, I'll see the tape. If I scroll down, I will see him denying it, right? He doesn't deny it in here. Not in the conversation, he denies it on Facebook. When I made the post after finding out, after trying to contact him, call him, so, inbox, uh, Facebook. Stop talking. He would not admit, he did not take it down. He was just denying it, ignoring me. So I did make the post because I knew that that's where he would respond to me at. You, that was my mistake. Wait, you made a post of what? I said, uh, around the time that Look I found out- Stop talking! I can't hear two people at once, what's wrong with you? Go ahead. Around the time I found out about the video on the 21st of February, that was around the same time that Black China had had her video leak. So that's what I said. So apparently Black China isn't the only one who has, ha who has had their sex tape leaked. And I told him that he would run me my coins. He would what? Run, run, run me my coins, give okay. me my money. Right, now, but did you post the video when you said? No. Okay. Did you when say where came, it was posted? No. You just said, this is what this guy did? Yes. Okay, that's fine. I want to see the Facebook messages. From the start? No, you know what I want? I want to see the porno tape. I want to see it in the Porno Hub site. Did you play that and record it? No, ma'am, I did not. 
Okay. Once I saw that that was that video, I didn't need to see it. I already had it in my phone. There was no purpose of watching what no, I No, but there is, because you're going to prove to me that he posted it, right? Yes. How are you going to do that? Because I went to his site on That's Pornhub. what I'm saying, oh, that you went to I'm the sorry, site I on Pornhub. You. Yes. That's what I mean. And according to you, it has his picture. Yes, ma'am. May, May I see it? Yes. Okay. Now, this is the picture of that's him. Next to that name. Yes. Right? And this is the picture that this is a tiny picture of. Right? Yes. In other words, he just took a picture of, like, his eyes to post on the actual porn site. And this is your Facebook picture. Can you explain this? Um, I have a public Facebook. So somebody's framing you? The young lady wanted to be attached to... How much money did you make off of this? I didn't make a dollar. The young lady want to be attached well, to me. How much more evidence do I need? Because I'm not going to do a naked lineup. You see? <laughs> the, the young lady. You know what? You have a counterclaim against her for $3,500. For what? No one knows about this situation. So my family. Well, they're going to um, know now, <laughs> aren't they? I'm a married man. Huh. Were you married when you had sex with her? Yes. You got to uh, make some better choices in your life, too, oh, I right? Am. I okay. am. Um, she, so you're she a said, married man that had sex with her, then posted it on the internet for profit. And you're a little, and, and so since you're married, you, you want somebody to pay you money because that turned out to be a really bad idea because now you're on national television defending yourself. I didn't post the video. She posted the video. And it's not me in the video. So your version. What, let me tell you who's going to know if it's you in the video. Mm-hmm. That's a problem, isn't it? <laughs> no, I, it's not me. It, so I'm, I'm okay with I'm okay So with you're it. okay with it. You see, life is filled with choices, and some of them are bad, and we're all human, and I get it. It might be a good idea to not be on ecstasy, not sell ecstasy, not let a guy on a one-night stand tape you, and then cry about it later, okay? There's a part of me that is saying that to you, okay? And, but that doesn't give that somebody the right to profit off of it and show it to the world and get 69 cents a, sh a peep, okay? It doesn't. How'd you get it off the site? You complained to the site? No, I didn't know how to have them take it down. Oh, okay. It was so you didn't even have anything to do with it being no, taken out. No, after I made the post and a lot of people were asking, was it him? Did he do and it? And then all of a sudden, it the was person who down. puts it up, who's not him, takes it down. Exactly. Oh, please. If it walks like a duck and it quacks like a duck, it's a duck. and it looks like a duck, it's a duck. How do you know about the three thousand? Because you saw how many... I've views. had two people tell me that Pornhub pays you to put amateur videos up. I didn't think it was the truth to that until Does I Does Pornhub actually... pay for videos? I'm not I looked aware. it up and they do. Uh, that was a, the right answer. I was trying to trick them. Uh, what? I, 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 I haven't got paid for many things. Okay. I, I, I don't think I'm going to engage in uh, calculating views. Um, I think I'm going to engage in the violation and breach of trust that it was. Um, and there's several things that a trier of fact considers, you know? I'd be lying if I didn't tell you, as I did earlier, that I am considering the fact that you did it at all. I'd be lying that, but again, that doesn't give them the right to make it public. I'd be lying if I didn't consider that you sent it to the potential baby mama, I guess, mm -hmm. and, um, because, you know, that's you publicizing it, too. But nobody has a right to do this to somebody else, nobody. And I am finding in your favor, I, I, and I would be lying if I, if I didn't say that it is really hard to identify you in that, and that a lot of the identification happened because you got so mad that it, but I don't blame you, because you got so mad that it was posted. Then all of a sudden, everybody's gonna start looking at it and knows about it and whatever else, um, because, you, you said something, but so what? You have a right to be angry that that violation happened. 
And you have a right to call attention to the violation, even if by doing so, you're calling attention to the tape as well. You have that right. That's what th these, that's what that guy banks on, that you're gonna keep your mouth shut about it. That's what he banks on. I'm finding in your favor in the amount of $5,000. You will pay her for that little privilege that you exercise. So the judge gives the plaintiff a judgment for $5,000 against you. That, that, you know, that's legal stuff. You gotta pay this. Yeah. What are you thinking right now? That's all she need. I mean, you say it wasn't you. You really didn't deny it that strongly. It, it wasn't me. You're not going to see my face in the video, none of my body parts. The young lady just want to be attached to me. It ain't nothing. Well, the judge is convinced it was you. That's your One more problem. What about your wife? Suppose she sees this. Think she's going to say it? i get another one. Another what? Wife. Oh, you're a winner. <laughs> OK. Goodbye. I don't know. You made a bad mistake, too. You know. A terrible mistake. Yeah. You're not going to do that again, huh? I haven't done it since. OK. I feel sorry for it. But good for you for suing, anyway. You know, maybe $5,000 will help. Thank you. Good luck to you. Well, Harvey, what do you think? OK, I mean, you should know, revenge porn, which is really awful, um, is becoming a crime in a lot of states. And judges are taking it really seriously as our prosecutors.